Hi, this is Leila Torres of OrigamiSpirit.com. We are going to be folding this rocking horse, a creation of José Tomás Buitrago. This is a lovely figure for making a mobile. To make a horse the size of my hand, we need a paper 6 by 6 inches or 15 by 15 centimeters. For the demonstration, we are going to use a bigger piece of paper. We have a paper that is white on one side and brown on the other side. If we want the head to be white and the mane to be dark, then we start with this white side up. To begin, we will be making this base, which is called preliminary base. Rotate your paper and we are going to create a central fold here and here. Open, we are going to turn the paper over and we are going to fold edge to edge and create the central folds. Now we are going to pick up the paper by these flaps and we are going to press toward the center and collapse. and we have made our preliminary base. We are going to create a fold corner to corner. Open, bring this corner to the intersection. We create that fold and we go back and refold on our previous fold. Turn it over and repeat. Now we are going to rotate and we are going to create a short fold here by bringing this corner to this intersection. We fold forward and also to the back. Now we are going to open briefly and we are going to reinforce those folds that we just made into mountain folds. This central square we are going to press from the side and start to sink it. Same here, very lightly so that the center goes all the way down. We position the paper like a sailing boat and we are going to create a fold parallel to the center vertical line about here by bringing this corner to here. Turn it over and repeat. Now we are going to open and we are going to inside reverse along that fold. That means that this frontal fold that is a valley reverses and becomes a mountain and we push from the side and inside reverse. Same on the other side. Now we are going to work with this flap. We are going to create a fold that is parallel to this slanted edge 
about here, that's to taste, is going to be the main. To do that, then we fold towards the right here. And this edge should be parallel to this. And we leave a space more or less like that. We open and again we are going to insert our finger and we're going to push this and reverse so that we have this. Now we're going to create the area of the nose. We can open for a moment and fold the tip down like so and we go back to here. Now we are going to create the tail. We are going to open here as if we uh, are turning the page of a book and we are going to bring these two edges to the center. And close. Now we are going to bring the, the tail down and to do that we are going to again reverse the folds. We are going to open this uh, area, insert our thumb there and with the index finger we are going to push down. Now the fold is going to begin at this point but inside just a little bit down from the edge. So we push down a little bit. And bring these two edges together. And this lower edge of the tail, we are going to make it match this corner. And we can press it flat. Now we are going to make a fold along here it's a mountain fold to hide this. Along that, we fold to the back. We turn and repeat the process here. The horse is made. To make a mobile, attach the horses by a line to a stick and suspend the unit from the ceiling. For more ideas, visit our related blog post at origamispirit.com.